Now if you want to do your surface skimming at treetop level, you take a plastic tarp, a lot of aluminum tubing, a 17 horsepower single cylinder electric start snowmobile engine, a 2 to 1 gear reducer, a 54 inch prop, and a kitchen chair, and bolt it all together, and you get Skyhook. I designed and built this aircraft to cruise along at a sedate 30 miles an hour. You don't debate whether or not you should buckle your seatbelt in this design. You will note that there is an end number, or tail number as some call it, on the wing. While this craft appears to be an ultralight, I built it in 1967, which predates the ultralight movement by nearly a decade, and I built it under the FAA Experimental Amateur Built Aircraft category. The T-shaped stick in front of me controls all roll, pitch, and yaw. You push it fore and aft for pitch control, push it to the side for roll control, and twist it for yaw control. The landing gear is a fiberglass spring, as you will notice here in this uh, somewhat abrupt landing. There is very little time to decide when to flare this aircraft as it glides at about a 4 to 1 glide ratio. It's 4 feet forward for each foot sinking. Note the fiberglass covered balsa propeller. The fuel tank is on top. The engine is mounted in soft rubber cup mountings. Note the spring gear. The rudder is a fiberglass over foam composite structure. Now this is the way you're supposed to put it down. Although I had to put it down here because the engine stopped running. <laughs> 